over. He knocks no. his head over. Fuck. No glue. Watch his head. Oh, ah! oh come on. Ah! Sorry. There's 200 of these ball bearings rolling around the shop, uh, the lab now. <laughs> God, oops, I just kicked one. In 2019, my husband Larry built a full-size Robbie the Robot replica costume, as you can see here. Now, a few months ago, we made a video of Larry giving a step-by-step -step explanation for how he built Robbie, and I'll put a link to that in the description box below in case you want to see that. But since we posted that video, we've gotten a whole lot of requests from people who want to see exactly what it takes to get Larry suited up inside his Robbie the Robot. So the other day we took a bunch of video and we videoed that whole process. And you know, on a good day it might take 20 minutes. And as you, like I'm saying here, you can see how it looked when it was done. But as you could also see in those little teaser snippets at the beginning of this video, we had a few glitches along the way. I hope you enjoy this video. If you have any questions at all or you request, uh, just let us know in the comments below. Thanks so much. Okay, we're rolling. Hi, everybody. Uh, I'm Larry. This is my Robbie. This is the way he sits in my lab. Uh, I got him in a, in a frame that is just like a human. So his shoulder harness is in there holding up basically the entire robot. And this is the way he sits in, in the lab. Now, this video is not to show you Robbie in his frame, but to show you how I get into him. <laughs> so it starts out with Robbie in his frame. The first thing we have to do is take him out of his frame. So I take out uh, his chest box. And his chest box is just a uh, press fit. So it comes out and usually there's some electrical connectors. I didn't connect them for this video. We'll show you plugging them back in. Take off his hands. These micro switches go to my finger so I can operate his sax valves and, uh, and his uh, analyzer. Those are so cool. Oops, I better look where I'm going. Yeah, be careful in the lab. Be careful in the lab. There's another uh, micro switch, one's for sax valves, one for analyzer valves. I'll take his head off. Uh, his head's on a uh, roller bearing, but it just slips out. It's like a Lazy Susan head, that's, neck. That's what, it's not a Lazy Susan, but it's like one. <laughs> <laughs> if it was a homemade Lazy Susan, that's what it would be. I'll sit his head right down in this. It's a soft cloth. He's sitting right on his polished dome, so it, it, it's uh, important that it doesn't fall over. Yeah, I see. Okay. <clears throat> now I'm going to take off his upper torso. It's also on a roller bearing. It just slips out. They put this over here. <laughs> yeah, I'm trying to back up without tripping over anything. my shoulder harness. Just a second. <laughs> Gotta walk over your shoulder harness. Yeah, this yeah, is my shoulder harness and this is what I'm gonna wear and it supports all of Robbie. You can see it's connected at the waist inside the waist bearing. And this is what the waist bearing uh, slips onto. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna disconnect Robbie's legs at the knees. Actually, maybe I just take him up. Maybe I won't take him up at the knees. Maybe I'll just. You yeah, haven't worn him since Halloween, have you? Uh, no. <clears throat> he 
he's not supported by his shoulder belt anymore. Now he's just supported by sitting on his legs. It's got to go before he can get out of here. Okay, so uh, we, we, we've got Robbie taken apart and we're getting ready to get in him. So I want to show you a little bit of uh, detail about what I call his fiberglass leader hose. And <laughs> these, this is the hip and uh, thigh sections of Robbie. I've got uh, molded in pivots oh. for the knee joints. Uh, the knees, and here's the shin, this gonna, my leg will go in here. The shin, uh, I don't have to put in, I don't have to put in a bolt or anything for that, for that knee joint. I just, uh, put it together and then his knees swivel. Now, <clears throat> in a full costume up, I've actually got these, uh, little orange, slice segments that go in behind his knees and they, they Velcro in and they cover up that back gap. But if I'm doing a front only uh, shoot or uh, so, I don't really even need these things. So we won't use these this time. Anyway, the, the knees come apart real easy. And this is this is where I'm at in, in getting into Robbie. At this point, I'll uh, get into the fiberglass leader hose in here. <laughs> I've got this. You should wear Robbie to Oktoberfest. <laughs> yeah, I, got <laughs> Freak people out. I got this tactical uh, belt here that uh, I, I get into, uh, you know, I can actually step in and throw it over my shoulders. And this, this supports the entire outfit. Yeah, it's been a while. There's no getting into Robbie alone. You need help getting into Robbie because <laughs> once I'm into this, I, I'm basically in a standing position and that's the end of it for me as far as if people have to hand me things and people have to connect my knees and feet. <laughs> and steer you around. Remember when we were at the museum and you almost walked into the people eating nachos? Yeah, visibility in Robbie <laughs> isn't perfect either. So it, it's always great to have a helper. All right. And be, you I, can't always hear all that great inside of there either. Right. If it's a noisy environment, especially, and Robbie's motors and stuff are going, you, you can't have, hear everything. Yeah, we haven't done this since uh, Halloween, so it's kind of like, oh, yeah, how did you do this again? <laughs> it's elaborate. Oh, okay. yeah. Okay. <laughs> there. This harness is going to hold up all of Robbie. Uh, next thing we do is we're going to attach the legs. We could put the camera on tripod, and uh, Tui's going to help me put the the shins on, and then the feet. 
All right, I better put it on a tripod. Yeah. All right. All right, now we're going to put the, the shin on my left leg here uh, and my foot. Are these right and left? Just the shin, not the foot. Yeah, we're going to put the foot on after. Right? Okay. All right. Try to get another shot. Gotta get my toe past that piece of foam. <laughs> Put the inside uh, pivot in first. <laughs> Why is this so hard? It's hard. <laughs> oh man. Oh, it's on there finally. Ta-da! Knees connected? Yeah. Yeah. So Ooh. there's the there's the knee joint. Now we'll put the foot on. Okay, now my foot. All right, and you got a shoe. Yeah. So that one might be easier. There. So my uh, leg is connected. Well, I'll, so the knee and the leg is connected on Robbie here. And uh, I'll adjust the straps on my support so that I re remove all gaps when the when the outfit is totally on. I can lower, in other words, I can lower the hip section to make the legs meet up perfect. All right. And then just repeat for the other leg. It's, it's so dark, it's really hard against your pants and everything. Like mm -hmm. if you wear khaki pants, I might be able to see it easier. Yeah, the, the reason I wear black Because uh, you don't show through yeah, any I gaps. Don't show through right. I gotcha. <laughs> <laughs> that makes sense. All right. All right, connect the inside pivot first. I can actually see the inside pivot on this way. That's nice, I can actually see it. I couldn't see it on the other side. Okay, that should be it. Ah, there. All right, let's check. Yeah, this side I can actually see. Okay, pivot's working. Now the shoe. <laughs> All right. Now for the shoe. Let me get over here, I think. Hold it. Put it down. Let it's it down. down. It's down. Oh. I was just trying to put it over so that your, your foot's no, not going No, my foot's on it. top of the shoe. I know. I, I was trying to move it over to get your foot in it. <laughs> okay, there. You should be able to feel your shoe now. Okay. He's actually got a pair of shoes inside the feet. Yeah, Robbie has uh, a pair of shoes that are permanently inside his feet. Okay, so here's my Robbie knees, legs, feet, and fiberglass leader hosen all set up. <laughs> and now I'm ready. Now I'm ready for the torso and so on. So I think we're gonna. Uh, you may need a wider shot because we're gonna get the torso on. Oh, okay. So you may back up. All right. Not too bad, not too much because there's just tops now, but. Okay. All right, so. Okay. Are we shooting? Yeah, it's been going the whole time. All right, so I've adjusted the height of my uh, waist piece here. This'll, this'll be the support for the bearing that, that uh, runs the torso and the head. Uh, and the next thing is, my wife is gonna hand me my torso <laughs> with that put on, and then we're gonna start, uh, it wi Robbie gets wired up, and uh, finish, finish getting in here. All right, torso. Now the torso is not in considerable weight. It's probably 20 pounds or 25 pounds. Plus, there's wires and things that have to get out, you know, get out of harm's way. I am staying out of the frame so people can see. Yeah, my arms pop out, which is real handy. 
Okay, you can move it out. I'll leave that. Okay, so uh, <laughs> here we're at the next stage of uh, Robbie. I can I can put in uh, my uh, my uh, chest piece now. It's on the other side here. Careful, on the left arm's gonna walk. Yeah, I don't I don't want to walk. We don't have head. enough room in here. My laboratory is full of <laughs> yeah <laughs> half finished projects and things. So oh, naturally, it's not now. All the electronics go together, and they. Uh, you have to be plugged up correctly. Do I have this upside down? Oh, it doesn't matter yet. Oh. I don't have a battery in Robbie yet. Uh, the battery weighs a few pounds, so it's easier to pick them up without the battery in it. And also for safety, I just don't do that. Okay, so uh, I've got my chest piece connected. I'm gonna uh, snap him in. With, everything kind of just snaps together in Robbie. Okay, chest piece is in. I'm just worried about your left arm. If you maybe can you even move just an inch to the, your right. Well, I'm I can just... put the arm actually in the. Okay, <laughs> so all right. I'm you go. Okay. All right. Okay. Ooh, How's great. that? Yeah. Danger. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Let's open that. So my arms. Uh, we track with uh, bungee cords that are internal and that it, it lets them pop out and hang down if I need to. Uh, next thing is uh, some of my electronics have to be attached to me. Uh, there's, there's a roll of blue tape right here and we're gonna... is a micro switch that operates uh, the, uh, the sax valves. Dino wants to take you up in here. Well, I could do this one, but yeah, and then you're gonna have to repeat repeat the procedure. <laughs> I like to have it just on my index finger. I could actually put. I have two things to control: the the chest piece analyzer panel and the uh, the sax valves. I like to just put them on the, my index fingers of both hands. I could do it on one hand. I could use the index finger and the middle finger or something like that, but. This, this is the way I like to operate. All right, so so I've got a micro switch on my finger here and I can operate. Yeah, here, I'm just making it. And this all fits inside Robbie's gloves. Now I'm gonna, it, I just wanted to show you that be, because I, I can be available to, you know, plug things up and stuff if I, if I don't put my micro switches on. So I'm gonna take it off and uh, we'll complete the, uh, the, the build here, if you will. All right, so the next thing that would go on, Bobby, uh, once I got that on, would be his head. So let's get his head. Well, not tall enough. Yeah, you're tall enough. I know that Ray did it last yeah, time. Yeah, but I'll take my arms out and I'll be able to help you. He'll move. Watch his head. Oh, ah. oh come on. Ah. Sorry. All right, let's see if there's anything left of the head to put on. <laughs> oh, God. You're going around. <laughs> Where are you going? Come back here. How do I get around you? Get over here in front of me. You think there's room? <laughs> Just pick up the head. Hold it. Let me get his wires. Up. Up. Head away. Hold it. All right. Put it to the side so people can see I'm connected. Okay. All right. So, Robbie's head. <laughs> there's three connectors for his head. That's his lights and his sax valves and his ear rotation power okay and uh then i got to turn on his voice boxes let me do that testing 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 do you see any of any anything going on in his uh, voice yeah all three segments lighting looks like it uh-huh okay good okay i'm gonna i'm gonna put his ears together and i'm gonna zoom out now it's time to power robbie up and make sure <laughs> Power up, Robbie. Make sure he's okay. Poor Robbie. All right, go around me. And there's a there's a Makita drill up on the stairs here. Drill. Oh, I see it. Okay. I need the battery from the drill. Oh. <laughs> All right. 
much. You're gonna have big hands for this. <laughs> My hands aren't big enough. I'm pushing it in. Bring the entire drill. <laughs> <laughs> Come on. <laughs> Okay, it wasn't just me. <laughs> Oops, there's razor blades all over. Okay, now it's time to make sure that Robbie is got any life in him. We gotta put his ears on. Oh yeah. And then there's that loopy thing. That's gonna get reinstalled. Then I'll turn him on. Okay. Maybe you should reinstall it before you put a new one. Uh, what thing are we gonna reinstall? The silver loopy thing. Oh, oh, yeah. I see what you're talking about. There's Velcro trying to. Come on, baby. Uh, there. Okay, his ears are on. Oops. <laughs> we powered Robbie up. <laughs> Is everything rotating both ears? Uh, no. Only one ear's rotating. The one that fell out isn't rotating. Connect his ear again. It's, uh, the Velcro has been connected. Oh, it's turning. Is the back light working or the front light working? Uh, the back light. And let me look at the front. Huh? Let me look at the front. Do it again. Yeah, the back light. The back light's out? No, no, the back light works. Awesome. <laughs> the front light doesn't I work. can't film it with the front light yeah. out. <laughs> well, I'm just saying. I gotta tell you the truth here. <laughs> okay, so now, to finish putting Robbie back, to, uh, getting in Robbie, now we put the arms in. And it's time to put my hands on. Gloves are over there, pretty. I see. <laughs> Here are the Robbie gloves. All right, squeeze it together a little and stick it in the cuff and the Velcro. Um, on. but what about the the? the Forget the switch. Oh, yeah, just leave the switch in. It's gotta be somewhere. <laughs> okay, there we go. Flip on the switch in the front panel, and then uh, we'll uh -huh. close the shot. Okay. <laughs> Just say. Robbie is complete. Okay, hang on a sec. Woo! Thank you for your patience. Another Robbie mishap as we took him apart. <laughs> oh my gosh. There are. Uh... There's 200 of these ball bearings rolling around the shop, uh, the lab now. <laughs> God, oops, I just kicked one. Yikes. Oh well, poor Robbie. Some assembly required. <laughs> okay. We're getting ready to film me asking these questions in Robbie's voice. So I have a script in here and a headlight so I could read it inside of Robbie. Look at that beanie, I love that beanie. It's like good for when you're camping and you wanna read in your tent uh, okay. or you're and, running around uh, in the dark. And I have an echo on my voice uh, for Rob Robbie. <laughs> and he reassembled Robbie because we, we had issues, poor little Rob. Okay, so now uh, we've gotta get his head on, uh -huh. stick his ear on. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> okay. Three, two, this one. Welcome to Hotel Four. I am Robbie the Robot. This is Welcome Robot. Oh yes. Yeah, this is good. Do 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 do. Do you use too much dialogue? Blah 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 blah. Let's chit chat. I want to get a full minute of this. Yes, indeed. Oh. What shall we do? Uh -huh. And I should know. Blah, blah, blah. I am Robbie the Robot. 
right. I was first used for the Derbicator. And yes, those cool lights I've got. I can move around and ask questions. And it's true. Do you use too many dialogue tags? Does your writing suck? Read it out loud. I don't know what body language is. I'm a robot. Welcome to a 365 writing group. I am Robbie, and this is what I have to say to you. I am a robot. Derp, 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 derp. That's me, Robski. Robot top of two way. Yes. We'll come back over. And that's it. I think that's probably pretty good. Two minutes of robbiness. Danger! Danger! <laughs> Well, that ought to be good. <laughs>